What's up guys, welcome, my name is Mikau and today we have a old school commentary. You know, you know, it's, is it old school? Is it old school? That is the question today. Is it old school doing a normal commentary? I honestly don't think it is, although people are doing it less because, you know, there's more interesting stuff to do. But I am not able to do a live commentary or, you know, whatever the new style of video you want to call it. Like, you know, a live commentary cutting all, you know, just the good parts. Uh, I don't really know what type of videos you call that. But uh, I don't have time to do that today because I have to stream. Portugal is playing against Germany. I'm, I'm a little bit scared. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little bit scared. But what I'm here... Uh, to talk about you guys today as you can see in the title is that uh, I left Gamma and you know I I'm solo again although the gameplay that you guys are watching is an old gameplay with the Gamma account uh, But yeah, I, I left Gamma and I Didn't want to make it's not that I didn't want to make a commentary about it But I thought there was uh, no need to do a commentary about it But apparently there's a lot of questions a lot of people want to know the reasons and just overall stuff like that so this commentary i'm gonna cover everything through uh you know why i left gamma what has been happening and you know what's what's the hopes for the future what's going on what's gonna happen all that good stuff okay so let's start from the beginning when i first was recruited to gamma what was the idea what was the objective of the team and uh let's start with that and we'll go with that and, and move on forward so uh, I first was approached by Cross, former Face Cross, uh, with the idea of creating a team uh, mainly based on personalities, you know, and, and the clip parts would uh, basically be something secondary because although every team right now is almost doing that, uh, when Gamma first first started, uh, there was there was really nothing like that or, you know, it was mainly about the clips and then the personality. Uh, so Pro uh, Cross approached me with the idea and he said, you know, that a ton of people with a lot of subscribers, each and every single one of them, uh, you know, including Pomage was in the team. So of course I was very interested. This was after I got dropped from Optic and, you know, things weren't uh, looking that good. I was in Obey, but um, nothing, nothing was really happening with me. Like I wasn't really doing anything besides just streaming. And, you know, just trying to go hard on Twitch. So, the team starts. We start uploading videos. We actually start growing really well. Like, our videos, every single video was getting, like, over 10, 15,000 views. You know, a lot of likes. Uh, Blue was in the team. And Blue, I think he survived, like, one week or two before, you know, everybody realized how good Blue is. And he joined FaZe, obviously, you know, Blue... I don't know how he does it, like, he's, I, I don't know, it's just, his aim on MW3, it's just, it's a little bit ridiculous, in my opinion, it's a little bit ridiculous, so that happened, and, I don't know why, but, like, after that, the team kind of starts slowing down, and no one started really promoting the team, y you know, we had, I believe, at least five guys, almost, with over a thousand, a uh, hundred thousand subscribers, and, you know, nothing was really happening. Uh, nobody was really promoting the team. And the content that was go that was uh, being uploaded to Gamma was mainly Call of Duty and, like, a, a news type of videos, you know. And then, you know, people start leaving because, you know, nothing was really going on. Nothing was really uh, happening. People start leaving and leaving and leaving. And one of the things that I was actually... I was not mad, but I was like... You know, they could have told us something was, you know, basically the leaders left and almost nobody in the team knew, which was a little bit weird. Um, so after after that, I, I was like, you know, I'll stay in the team because honestly, at that time, I had nowhere to go and phase five was about to start. So phase five starts. I honestly, you know, I don't want to be mean or anything. I, don't, I I love the people in Gamma. Like, every single one of them are really, really cool guys. But, you know, about the channel, there was almost nothing being done. And um, with the Phase 5, it was it was a really eye-opening, you know. My stream started ticking off. My YouTube now is getting a lot of subs. I don't even know how. Like, thank you guys so, so much. And, uh, you know, I, I, I decided that after the Phase 5, I was going to do something about it. 
So I decided to leave Gamma and uh, I am now a solo player, although I was basically solo already. And uh, yeah, that, that is what it is, you know, after the phase 5, Banks said that they were going to recruit a handful of players. I will not give up, I will, I mean, of course, you know, if I don't get into phase 5, it's not that I'm going to be demotivated, it's just, you know, damn, I, I wish I was in the phase 5. But it's all good, I'll keep going out on videos, live streams, all that good stuff. If you have any more questions, feel free to leave them down below in the comments. I love you guys, and I'll see you on the next video.